come along with me today as I fly Munich to Vienna on Lufthansa City Line on a CRJ. Check in, we go. I saw these reclining chairs here, so naturally I had to go try one out. But I can report to you from first hand, they are not comfortable at all. So my seat on this flight is six alpha and just by looking at it right here I could already tell it was not going to be very comfortable and on uh, this CRJ I brought my own water because I didn't know if they were going to pass anything out and I think <laughs> I think it's actually for my other Lufthansa flight the other day but as you can tell the leg room isn't great and the tray is much bigger than I thought it would be um, I'm not sure why you would need that big of a tray for these shorter regional jet flights but the seat cushion is more comfortable than I thought it was so that is a major plus <laughs> Good day, dear guests, and a very warm welcome here on board on our way to Vienna. Our flight is fully booked, that's why we would kindly ask you to also use little, the space uh, in front of you to put your hand luggage. Unless you're sitting in our first row or emergency exit rows number 16 or 18, then you are required to store all of your hand luggage, including your jackets or small bags, in the overhead compartments only. So, as you can see, on this aircraft with Lufthansa, you'd either have to choose eating your meal with legroom or your legroom because it's a struggle to do both. You can't eat a meal at the tray and have enough legroom, but of course I have my backpack under the seat, so if you don't have your backpack under the seat, that may help.
told you, look at that. Now it is our turn to take off. Only a couple of minutes after our departure time, I think, so it was only a few minutes delayed. But I think there was a queue of three or four aircraft ahead of us. So all in all, not not too bad, not too late of a departure. So that's that's always good. or that's exactly what I needed.
So I think it's only been about half an hour and we're already descending into Vienna, but of course Munich and Vienna aren't really that far apart, so I shouldn't be surprised. But unfortunately, most of the flight was cloudy like this, so there wasn't really much to film outside the window. And I don't want to bore you guys just watching clouds go by like that. So this video is a little bit shorter. I apologize, but I didn't want to just show you all the clouds the whole time. So. This is Vienna and it looks pretty cloudy out there today but still some pretty good uh, video that I can film and this landing as you're about to see is one of the smoothest I've ever experienced in my life so props to Lufthansa City Line I'm not even kidding you that was a great landing that was almost perfect in my book Isn't that a thing of beauty? I love that. <laughs> so, we have finally made it to Vienna, Austria. I'm really excited for this. And as always, thank you for watching. And I will see you on our next video.